To tie a zig rig, you will need the following components. A tail rubber and lead clip, a size eight swivel, your chosen size swivel lead, this depends on your particular fishing situation and how far you need to cast. A spool of zig line, this comes in a few different breaking strains, so pick one that suits the water you're fishing. A size eight, 10 or 12 mixer hook. Normally the spookier the carp, the smaller the hook will use. Your chosen zig hook bait, here I'm just using a small pop-up, but a small piece of foam like this would also do the job perfectly. An anti-tangle sleeve, and lastly, you'll need a baiting needle, bait stops, and a pair of scissors. Start off by threading the tail rubber and lead clip onto your main line. Next, tie on a size eight swivel. We like to use a simple half blood knot, passing the line through the eye of the swivel before wrapping the line around itself around seven times and threading it back through the hole you created. You can now pull the swivel into the back of the lead clip. It should click into place. Take the swivel lead and thread it onto the lead clip and push the tail rubber lightly over the top. You've now made up the lead system, so next all you need to do is tie up the actual hook link section. Take off your chosen length of zig line. I'm going to just use a short length for demonstrational purposes. In one end, you need to tie a small overhand loop knot to act as your hair to thread your hook bait onto. Take your chosen hook bait and thread it onto a baiting needle and then onto the loop you just created. Hold the bait in place with a bait stop. Now it's time to attach your hook. Thread the other end of your hook link through the back of the eye of your hook. Pull it up tight to the bait so it sits like this. Now you need to tie a knotless knot, wrapping the line round the shank of the hook seven or eight times, before pushing the line back through the eye of the hook and pulling it tight. With the hook and bait attached, you can now thread on your anti-tangle sleeve onto the hook link. Make sure you thread it on the correct way. Next, tie a loop in the end of the hook link. A figure of eight loop knot will do the job perfectly. To attach the loop to the swivel on the lead clip, simply thread the loop through the hole in the swivel before passing the rest of the zig rig through the same loop and pull it down tight. Your zig rig is now complete. As you can see, the sleeve here helps avoid tangles. However, you are bound to get tangled every now and then with such a long hook link like this. To learn how to tie loads more carp fishing rigs, then click the playlist on screen now. See you next time.